So I think that, like what she said, um, it's, it's key to identify where your customers are, and just say identify where, where they are. Now, if you take a fish out of the water and put it in dry land, it's not the The fish will not survive it, or not for that long. Um, her market place was TikTok, and I'm sure she's getting ads. She's making money off of ads. She's getting probably uh, some kind of, uh, what they call this, uh, sponsorship and so, no, um, endorsement, uh, endorsement, 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 exactly. She's making, making money off that too. Now, the moment she takes her Gen Z audience out of their vibe land mm -hmm. to the real world of meet and greet, mm -hmm. which they are really not interested in. Exactly. So what, what does that mean? It means that you also, don't, you also need to know where your customers are and where they want to play. If you have what's working, why are you changing? Why are you, why are you, why are you, re, re, why are you rejigging the wheel? It's working for you, you're in your space, it's online. It's online in real time. They can see you here in 10 seconds, 10 seconds, and they're, and, they're, and, they're, and they're okay with it, and you're getting the views. Guess what, like he even said, the video she made of, um, of uh, herself oh, look, not happy about what happened, happened mm -hmm. went viral. Guess what? That's going to give her more views. That's it means that, that it means that, yes. I didn't know the camera was doing that before at that time, yeah. yeah. So it means that she's making content in the same marketplace where she's supposed to be selling. Not in a, in a more way you are uh, expensive to come and meet and greet. So you should also understand your 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 demographic, your the audience, your your uh, uh, customer's demography. Now, if she was dealing with people who are like uh, in their fifties or forties, they probably would turn up for the, for the meetings. They used to it in in uh, thirty years ago. There was no mobile phones, so we had to like do letters or just drive just drive down. Maybe we would leave a house. You get. So they probably would show up for those kind of meetings. So know know your know your, your customer. Know where they want to play. If you are in the tech space and you're trying to have uh, physical meetings all the time, you want to get audience. There's MS Teams, there's Google Meets, there's Zoom, there's all manner of uh, platforms you can meet with your clients. So yeah, that's what we're just pointing out basically. Yes, I think that's valid, and I even think about it that way. Like that was her marketplace. Yeah. And people didn't want to meet physically, right? So um, maybe we touch on other industries. But how do you market online? I think we have people in the fashion space here. How do you, how do you market online? Um, you introduce yourself, just kidding. Okay, everyone, my name is um, Mary. I'm the CEO of Money Craft. I make leather bags, belts, and I can so, sorry guys, I'm also wondering how you guys picked this uh, topic over over funding. Wow. Wow. What I think we're discussing is actually not customer is customer, it's access to market. And if you look at the needs for SME2, after access to finance. Access to market. Yes. So I think they don't believe in the audience. Can I also tell you? The audience. The audience. The audience. The answer. If you go and meet tech boys in their mid 20s, in their mid 20s, they'll turn you for a reason. Of course. If you go and meet an OG, plenty of battle scars, it's not for a reason. Because we've seen boys raise money and blow it. We still talk about it here. Tech about. When you said you guys started in 2015, you said we paid your dues. Take a bar, raise money. They are not, do you understand? Fact, they raise money, they are not there. So you can raise money and you can blow it. I had a friend, 100 million, when we left school, he bought tankers. He sold all the tankers, plus tire, plus everything. 100 M. I'm talking almost 20 years ago. So it's not money. Do you understand that? It's important, but that's not the only thing. I, I agree with you. I agree with you. But I think it also depends on the channel to which you make. And I tell to people, look, I have a colleague who was working in went to Fort Bank. He said, look, in Fort Bank, I'm going to go for that. And he said, look, there is war there. I speak to George every weekend. And he said, there is war there. Young guy is going to bed, and they get funds. Now, let me tell you one of the dangerous problems with the funds we get in Nigeria now. I can tell you here now that one of the things Nigerians know how to do, they are very smart in perfecting the craft. I can tell you, sitting down here, the four things you need to do to set up a business. Set up a business in two years.